Kenneth Dean with the Tyler Morning Telegraph here. We have just received new video in regards to Jeffrey Eugene Brooks. Now this new video that we've received from the Mineola Police Department under an information request shows Brooks in the Smith County Sheriff's vehicle that he stole pulling up to a motel in Lindell where a Mineola officer was standing by just in case that Brooks came back. What happened next, you can see for yourself. I have a feeling of that. Well, I figured he was selling a little something. But. He probably got about the best weed that I've seen in a while. That's if that's the same one they arrested like a couple months ago, then that's... Back up. What is this? Back up. I just don't want to hit you. Get on the ground! Down, Levi. I'm right here. I ain't going That is crazy. Mini 226, I need you to contact Smith County. Shots fired. Jeff Brooks just pulled up in the Smith County car and he uh he had a weapon. Uh, shots fired on my behalf. Oh my god. Stay down. You didn't know it was him, did you? No. Get in the house. Get in. Just stay right there. Stay down. Stay down. Hey, when he pulled up, did I see his head? I knew that was him. The shape of his head. He had a dent. He had a gun in his hand. I bet he did. Captain Joyce Box of the Mineola Police Department tells me today that the department is very fortunate their officer was not shot and killed during this exchange with Brooks. Now Brooks pointed the handgun at him as soon as he pulled into the parking lot. The officer's reaction, she says, were warranted and he, he did his job. Now Brooks, of course, was not injured in this exchange. He uh, then led deputies on multiple more chases throughout the county. Uh, he then eluded uh, authorities for two days until he was found early Sunday morning in the Clute area. Now when he was found then, he came out of a house brandishing a firearm, jumped into yet another vehicle and tried to run over multiple officers. He was shot and killed.